Even you, Viva Zayu, when you be opening your legs, enjoying your marriage program, well, well, I also come to you. I will come and set your face like that. If you want Waka now, I don't care. Uh, waka, if you want Waka, my brother says, don't worry about him. Don't worry about Idri or anybody else. Idri is laughing. <laughs> Viva Zayu. <laughs> hey. Come on. If you know the one in us is greater than everything that I hate, come on, lift your hands up. And if you know the name of Jesus Christ is greater than each and every other name Come on you, stand on the word, believe in the truth We know our God will never ever fail This world will live by the rules of this earth But we live by the power and the mercy of the Lord For oh, He is mighty, He is powerful He is capable and able to do each and everything What you think might change tomorrow Because the purpose of God is always greater for you Yes, I will come the purpose and the plan of God Over each and every nation city and the people yes cause we know no matter what even though we face bad difficulty things when it comes to jesus he's our rock he's our anchor he's our shepherd and our chief cornerstone and he will never give us anything bad jeremiah 29 11 tells us that i know the purpose and the plan i have for you it's never to harm you or hurt you no no viva zion when he gives you believe me sis it's gonna change how you think and everything and how you saw it that's why keep on waiting on the purpose and plan of the one and only sovereign Lord God is coming. Even when you're 60, even when you're 80, have you not seen on Facebook other women getting pregnant? And this generation has not seen miracles, signs and wonders that are happening right in our face. They are really wondering how a 64 year old woman can get pregnant. It's the will and purpose of the Lord. Sarah was about 80 years in the Bible. If you know the God you say, why are you doubting right now? That's why when I tell my sister, it is like that. I'll be a big sister, just an auntie, and I will do it. Come on, don't you doubt, don't you worry And if it gives you a child in a latter age Come on, then you know You will live to belong like nobody else Come on! It means you be Papa Abraham It means you be Mama Sarah It means the grace upon you is greater You go live to see your Isaac Become a big man, become a father And a husband, Think God Give them the grace like that He's not a God of confusion, he's the God of order He will not give you a child in older age And not let you enjoy it, no He will give you the right need and strength Even your back will be really ready To carry that baby Never get tired That's the God of Jesus, the one and only super in Lord, come on Do you believe me? And my word, but the word of God <laughs> Do you believe me? And my word, but the word of God Our generation is shocked right now There are two women going viral on social media One 64 pregnant like that And the other one is 80 I am saying, don't be shocked You see, Jesus has to allow that baby to be born now Maybe it's the Abraham or that Moses of our generation So if my sister Idris is carrying Abraham I say, fire Lord, fire Lord <laughs> Fire, 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 fire Lord We're going to help you, don't worry We're going to help you in fact, some of you, if you are very afraid like Idri, be asking the Lord to be sending that baby to our area. Because me, to tell you the truth, it's just that Papa Rafa said that we are old. If, he, if I give him more baby, one more baby, he go move out of our house, he go stay with him, Mama. But my fallopian too, my placenta, he didn't feel like he can carry two more picking. <laughs> Come on now. <laughs> Praise the Lord, <laughs> Idris. <laughs> Somebody say, I know Sabi where this take all this talent, true gifted. This talent is for the heaven right now. It's better than being a Beyonce and a Jay-Z. And that's why I'm always going to take time to teach the people who don't know who I am and what I'm doing. I am Apostle Rachel Bord, daughter of the Most Great High. Mm -hmm. I am an apostle. I am not an influence. I am not an influencer, I am not either a singer. The gift for the music, it's mine. God gave it to me. I intentionally, Brother Jazunda, I intentionally use it for the Lord. And I don't want people to write comments like I'm wasting my gift, because that hurts. 
I can never waste my gift when I'm praising the Lord. Stop making me feel like I'm poor, I am less, or there is something wrong with me. I shut you up because you ain't got even know if you cannot even do what I do with this gift. Humble yourself. Take several seats. Tell your father, Satan, not to talk. Because if I know that he's in the people, I will come out of the order. I'll come and choke him. Take his throat out. Don't try me. Look what I said. Don't try me. I ain't your friend, Satan. So don't make me look like what I do is wasting time. Don't look like you know better than God. Who are you? You just discovered me here. He gave me this gift. He even knows how to run it and control it. So why is it always people always wonder, I'm wasting my gift. What is she doing with her gift? Excuse me. I'm saving the Lord. And stop making people who are saving God in spirit and in truth, who are different from you, feel like there is something wrong with them. Ain't nothing wrong with me. I chose to save God in spirit and in truth. And the God of Abraham did not say we should come with our gift here and sell them. He said those in truth and in spirit worship us. Go out there and worship the Lord. Let me worship. Don't start none, won't be none. Don't start none, won't be none, Jeza. Won't start none, won't, don't start none, won't be none, Satan. I beg you in Jesus' name. Get behind me. Get under my feet. And shut up. And this is why people have felt like they were less running to studios. Isn't it, Viva Zion, Sharon, isn't it? Brother Elvin, you know what I'm talking about. People actually are comfortable to praise the Lord in, in spirit and in truth without a microphone, with their background looking simple. There comes the haters, always looking like they see more. What do you see that the Lord cannot see? What you see better that the Lord cannot see? That's why I wonder, the people want to talk to me. Didn't you see God? Didn't you see God? I am with God. And I will stand on it. I'm not poor. I'm not wasting my talent. I am not ugly. And I am not dirty too. And I am not mad or mentally disturbed. I'm canceling those things. But whatever will come out of my tongue and my lip, the same when I your own mouth go open, receive it in Jesus' name. In the sacred place. Go and cry and pray to your father. When I play with people who don't play with you. Koi koi. It's too much. You want everybody to be CC wine and Chandler more? The Lord did not make it like that. The Lord did not allow this gift, this talent to be manufactured and polluted by where I'm coming from in Zambia. Oh, I made the Zambian music industry. There's some blood of mine in there. There's my, my, my lineage and my children in there. Some great artists are sitting on the properties of my children. Because without writing and singing those things for them, they would have never made it. I chose to leave that. Why you want to? That's why even the Justin Bieber's, they are afraid to leave the stage. Because every time God says, go and praise, come and see somebody, go and tell Justin Bieber, your gift deserves to be at the stage. I've been on a lot of stages in my life. I have met a lot of big artists in my life. But the greatest platform and place I've been is right at the altar of the Lord in his presence. These other things, ain't nobody got time for it. Don't even bring it up because this is where you're building low self-esteem in others. How you see better? How you see better? Oh, tell them, Viva Zen, when you come here, come and enjoy. If you had only seen me for the talent and the music, we are not on the same level and you're not my friend because you are, you are really Satan's child because Satan was so focused on his gift. Instead of what a gift can do. Stay left. Take the whole babies for Satan. But everybody who loves the Lord, we are not here for the beautiful voice. And I'm not wasting my life. And I'm not wasting my time. And if the God of Abraham I was saving you was letting me to starve, I would be using manipulation to my talent to feed. I already bought a house in half a million as a street worshiper for Jesus Christ in Europe. So the Lord can pay millions when you're on the street in spirit and in truth. You want me to enter studio? To do what? That's when it will show that I'm really using my talent. All of you coming here, is it not all of you? Can you not see me? What is wrong with this praise and worship? Nothing. But the body of Christ has refused to empower iron sharpened iron. Not this body of Jesus Christ on the earth. It not be iron sharpened iron. It be liars manipulating others. God help us. Stop making people feel less. That's what I was talking about yesterday night. Stop coming to people's channels and so bored and confident speaking to them. Stop it.
God has not given you that right. Stop it. Stop it. Stop speaking over people's lives. Stop feeling comfortable like that. Stop it. For take man. Stop it. Stop speaking over people's lives. Stop allowing your brothers and sisters to lose a relationship with God because they listen to you. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. The reason why you are losing now when you see Ch Ch Chandler Mo with Cake Franklin, you are crying Chandler Mo has gone with Cake Franklin. Because when they were praising in that, in that basement, Chandra uh, and his group, Maverick Seed, they were more anointed, there was more power of the Lord that was happening in there. You people were not happy. You made sure that those people go Grammys now. These days when Chandler and the group sing, I don't feel not even one small piece of Holy Ghost. You quench the anointing, run it test. Now you people... Who like to come on pages like Brother Jazunda? Better not be God's enemy if you want to be saved. Let's walk with order. Because some of you, these worshippers that you are seeing recording music, it's because of the comments you write. So all of us, you are going to see Jesus in us when we are when we are half billion, when we are millionaires like C.C. Wine. So for us to be seen that we have Jesus, we have to be millionaires like Tasha Cobbs. It's a lie, you. It's a lie. And I'll say it out here, but... Stop accusing the name of the Lord. The Lord never said anything like that. Why you lie? Why you lie? Spirit of lie. Spirit of confusion. Always making your brothers and sisters in Christ feel like the God they save is, is not enough. You people cannot support your generation to save God in spirit and in truth. You people help your generation to leave the presence of God to go and start doing things for the world. I really have to dress up for you people you know what I find funny? The people who have Holy Ghost and Holy Spirit, they will never see a talent in me or a gift. It's the anointing. It's more than what a talent is. The people who are in the world, they are fo so focused on talent. Keep your talents. Don't you think I'm aware and conscious myself that I've, I have one of a kind talent? You think to put instrument and start singing, you've never heard instruments and you're just singing in the flow, is my own man, my own choice. No, it's a gift from the Lord. Don't you think I'm aware of the gift that the Lord has given me? Don't you think that the professional, professor musician I'm married to, did not see it? Hello? You think so? Stop diverting others. And Sister Felicia, thank you for your message, my sister. But at this point, we were not talking to you, my sister. And I hope that you, you can focus to help others that need you in the comments right now. I'm not talking to you. The person I was addressing is not responding. They are probably listening. I was not talking to you, my sister. And you, Pastor, uh, Sister Felicia, you will not stop me in the presence of God as the Holy Spirit leads when to talk and what not to talk. And if it's winning souls, I don't win souls with my gift by singing. I don't. Winning souls is doing, teaching people the right doctrine, the sound doctrine of Jesus. And the sound doctrine of Jesus Christ is not about gifts. You hate me, but I always just come to preach the truth for you. The sound doctrine is telling your brother and sister not to worship their own gift. The sound doctrine of Jesus is to stand on the truth no matter how many men are telling you to shut up. That's the sound doctrine of Jesus. Sister Felicia, if you are my father's child, don't bring confusion, my sister. In this time, what have I said wrong that I need to be corrected? And what did I say that is a lie? Because you are allowed to correct me.